my introduction to music. It was just, there's just always guitars lying around. The first guitar I had, which was this guitar I rescued from the dumpster. This steel string guitar that was just impossible to play. The action was up here. And I do remember it going out of tune quite frequently and, you know, strings buzzing. It was just an unplugged electric upside down headstock. It had like all sorts of screw holes in it. It was a toy. It was a prop, or at least that's what I thought. It maybe only had two strings on it. It looked like 40 people had owned it before me. It was never a guitar that I wanted to to pick up and play for hours. You're wrestling against that instrument and it steals the joy. I wasn't inspired by it, I guess. That first guitar is just such a big part of where you go. It's, it's got to feel good. And you want it to stay in tune. How accessible the chords are. If I had this guitar when I was 13, what if? I can only imagine how much more confident I would have been. This guitar is sexy, so it would have made it like a whole like cooler thing already. I never would have thought that I could afford a guitar that played or sounded this good. But I think if I had something like this in my hands and I was playing the same chords I was learning. I know my journey would have been different. Can I use this vehicle to express emotion that's inside of me? And I think that's what got me into like that's amazing, just the way that it feels. I wrote my first song and I was like, there's no turning back. I thought that if he can do it, why can't I do it? It meant freedom. Hey, my name is John Foreman. Hey, what's up? I'm Jason Mraz. Hey, I'm Bo Burchell. I'm a singer, songwriter. Surfer. A record producer. Mother. A guitar player. Guitar player. Guitar player. And this. And this. And this is the Academy Series.